Hey, how's it going? It's Tim Brown, and this is another episode of Google Likes It. Today we're going to be talking about how Google likes it when you silo your content. So what does a silo mean? Well, a silo essentially means a particular category of content. So Google likes it when you have categories delineated within your website, and you can only access that content from that category. So if you go into a library, for instance, there are different sections of the library. There might be comics and fiction and nonfiction and history and religion and science. And essentially within those particular categories, you know what you're going to find, but you don't need to access all of that content from the front of the library. You want to be able to get to those places easily, but you don't need to access it all right away. And that is essentially the concept that Google respects in websites. If they're well categorized, and if when you go into that area, you can access everything easily. So some of the concepts to get the most out of silos within your website are, you wanna plan content groups logically. So from the outset, when you're designing your website, think about the specific categories of content. And you might wanna do a little keyword research, and you might wanna really think about the way people are accessing this content and what they really want. You may not need a category for everything. So it's figuring out which categories are the most relevant to the people on your website and then grouping them out. And then you also want to use URL structure like a subfolder slash subfolder slash sub item. So when possible, try to group it in the URL as well. So subfolder slash sub item. And lastly, when appropriate, you want to create sub nav systems. So if you have that top navigation bar that a lot of websites have nowadays, perhaps you also want to include a sidebar menu where appropriate in that area of the website. So if you're drilling down into, let's say, fiction, for, for instance, perhaps you have the different subcategories of fiction there on the sidebar. This will allow interlinking. You know, one of the recent Google Likes It videos, we're talking about how having a lot of intuitive links around the website internally is really smart for SEO. And having that in there is really good for user experience as well. So use silos on your website where appropriate. And join us next week for Google Likes It. Bye.